How's it going? Thanks for checking out another one of my videos. Today I'm going to be making a thin blue line call out of a epoxy with black pigment and a thin layer of blue acrylic that I've sanded down and uh, put on the inside. I did this with one of my cutting board molds and if you want to see how I do that I've got another video that shows how I put those together. It's just a reusable mold so here I'm drilling it out to 5 eighths of an inch which is the right size to accept the call inserts that I use, which are from Echo Calls. So first thing I do, drill it out to 5 eighths of an inch all the way through. So once I've got it drilled out to 5 eighths of an inch, I swap out the chuck for my 5 eighths arbor, tighten it down on there, and I'm using a roughing gouge here to round out, or get it fairly close to round before starting with the actual process of shaping the call. So I flatten one end and then I put my band on here and I'll use calipers to measure it and scribe a line on the end that's already flattened so I know where to cut and make it the same width as the band. So I get the call machine down semi close to the size of the band and then I just kind of trial and error it here until it fits snugly, um, at which point I'll take it off and then I'll use a, a little hammer to press fit it on. So after that I'll chuck it back up and then I'll use my cutoff tool to cut a flat part about a quarter of an inch beyond the band. I don't actually measure much of this at all. I just kind of eyeball everything, but then I cut the groove for the lanyard in there after that and then start shaping the call itself. All right, then it's sanding time. So I started out with 120 grit here just because my tools weren't very sharp and my cuts weren't very good on this particular one. So started out at 120 grit uh, and I'll sand across the grain or across my sanding grains like that to kind of smooth it out. But after I went up to uh, 400 grit and I moved over to this Axe abrasive sanding paste, which is some awesome stuff. Definitely check them out. And I rub it on there and uh, Go through that until it breaks down fully. Then I'll go to the X polishing compound and finish it off with that. And after this, I went over it with OB Shine Juice, um, and I only did a couple coats of it just to give it a little bit of a, a polish look. And that is it. So at this point, I put the insert in, and again, I use inserts from Echo Calls. I believe it's echocalls.com. Uh, I'm using a single read open water uh, black insert on this one. Uh, their inserts sound awesome. And <clears throat> really, again, for me, it's just about making the barrels. That's just what I love doing. So, yep, thanks for watching and please subscribe.